All right, thanks, TJ. Pinpoint Weather Team coverage continues now all morning. We've been watching the shoreline along uh, Narragansett here from our camera. Waves have been picking up with the stormy weather and the strong winds. And right now, Eyewitness News reporter Kate Walsh live in Narragansett with details on the conditions down there on the coast. Kate? Well, Patrick, you might be able to tell the wind is really picking up now here at the Port of Galilee. The Block Island Ferry is park is docked right behind us. And on the other side of the ticket counter here is the high speed ferry. Now we see people coming here trying to figure out what the conditions are for this afternoon. And here's what they're seeing when they show up today. The windows are closed with signs saying all high speed ferries have been canceled. The 9 a.m. ferry to Block Island one is scheduled as did the 815 from Block Island to Point Judith. We're expecting the 1145 to be coming to Point Judith from Block Island as well, and then that's about it. I spoke with the Coast Guard here who said it's strongly advised no boats go out unless you're extremely experienced, and they said the same goes for any surfers. This time of year, a lot of the people going to Block Island are people who live there coming to and from the mainland, so to speak, for business, and we spoke with one former fisherman who was hoping to bring his friend back home to Block Island today. I mean, home was over there, you know. Yeah. And the only other choice you had would be to go Westerly. You might be able to fly them over, but I don't even know if they want to do that on a Westerly airport. Mm -hmm. We just spoke with some commercial sword fishermen who said they just docked here and it was pretty choppy out there and they plan on staying docked until at least Friday now just to play it safe. They said there's no way fishermen should go out there right now. So we'll continue to track the conditions down here for you. The Coast Guard again advising that there is going to be choppy waves for most of the rest of the week and to really play it safe. They will be on standby. They don't have extra patrols out here, but they're on standby so that they're nice and fresh if an emergency does arrive. Arise live in Narragansett. I'm Kate Walsh, Eyewitness News. And we'll bring you updates throughout the stretch of weather here, both on air and online at WPRI.com. Be sure to download our Pinpoint Weather 12 app where you can see the updates sent right to your smartphone.